Hello, good people of the free world. Tom Selly here with my fourth edition of Live on the Cloud, cloud living at its finest. Today, I want to talk about social bookmarking. Gone are the days where you're going to save a bookmark in your browser, and then when you're on your netbook computer, you don't have access to it. Now, I know that uh, Firefox does, uh, forgive me, that Chrome does this synchronization thing, which is very cool because in 2011 and moving forward, whatever year it is that you happen to be watching this video, we want all of our data to be synced. That's what cloud living is all about. So let's talk about Digo because the thing I like about Digo is it's much more than just social bookmarking. Uh, the, first of all, it always lives in the cloud, just like any social bookmarking service, but it's more than just bookmarks. It allows you to highlight text and copy in the pages. It allows you to include sticky notes. The great thing about the sticky notes is it's basically you can annotate the page and you can make it public so anyone else that has Digo can see those notes or you can make them private and you can choose to invite your colleagues and friends to those notes. You can save images and documents. Obviously you can make bookmarks and the, probably the best thing that I like about Digo is it allows you to archive. You know, their tagline is annotate, archive, organize. Have you ever been to a social bookmark or have you ever been to a bookmark of a page that you saved and some months or even years later you go to that bookmark and it's gone? Well, Digo will allow you to actually take a snapshot of the page and to save the, the page in an archive, there might be a recipe, there might be an important article with information you didn't have the time to read. So it's all accessible to you, archived, whether or not that web page goes away or not. And that's very, very powerful. The other thing I, I like is obviously it's cross-platform. So, you know, you could be standing in the checkout line at the grocery store and you've got a couple extra minutes. You can grab your Android phone and look at some of those, some of the content that you didn't have time to read when you were in the office or at home. So definitely check out DIIGO.com. It's a service I've been using for years. I highly recommend it. And until next time, this is Tom Selly saying thanks and God bless.